All right. Welcome back to Star Ocean 6. We're about to go to Malkia's room again. Oops, wrong button. Oops, wrong button. What is that? Oh, quest list. Yeah, duh. Okay. Commence cutscene. Now, before we begin mining for Levitas ore, there is one thing I would ask. Something else? I thought we already chased off the Empire. This is serious. It takes significant strength to excavate the ore, but many of the villagers are wounded. We are not in the best shape ourselves. I'm good. Especially you, boy. Huh? These 14 long years must have been difficult. The creaking of my old osseous core due to our close proximity must not be helping matters. Uh, no, I am fine. Do not hold in the pain any longer. There is no need. What? Midas and I have discussed it. I will bestow upon you a new osseous core. A renewed arm should allow you to resume your duties. Oh, well, Baird! Uh, uh, are... are... Are you certain? Consider it a fitting reward for a hero who saved my people. Midas also keeps bringing up that if we do not repair your arm, he would be at the whim of the royal family forevermore. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's great, Albert. Now you can go on being a knight. I, I, I can hardly believe it. Thank you. Thank you. The implantation procedure should only take one night. Let us all rest in anticipation of our journey for the Levitas Ore come the morrow. That was private action time. Can I go in here? Oh. Come on, Duma. Let's go talk to people. Well, everybody's in the end. Okay. Makes things simple. Quite the hard worker, eh? But the more I try. Just so you know. They're letting me stand in as assistant, but I'm pretty anxious. The main issue was discerning whether we could procure another osseous core from Ma with her help. Don't even know what an osseous core is, but I'll trust I feel you. Incredibly moved to be able to. Uh. I... I can continue my nightly duties. I can still fight. They're essentially extending your lifespan. You speak true. Now I can repay Her Highness for all the worry I've caused her. Leticia's not here, by the way. Where'd she get to? Yeah. I do not doubt there is much running through her mind. If... If Her Highness should speak to you, I beg you, heed her words. Nah. Hey, what's this all of a sudden? You've been acting weird lately. Her Highness holds trust in you. Despite this trust, there were matters she could not share. Perhaps now, such conversation is possible. Yeah, I got it. And if I don't do as you say, you'd probably end up a pain in my ass anyways. Shall we begin the procedure? Yes, my lady. I want to see where they pull that core out of. All right. I better find Leticia. Only three possible holes. Hmm. 
Years ago, we had to transplant his entire arm. We need only implant an osseous core this time. Do not look so worried. Okay. Where the hell is Leticia? Did she go outside somewhere? Huh? Not this again. Aha, I've brained up and got a door in my face. How about you? you by any Start from window continent in the head. Did I ever see if I could do any kind of quest for you? I did not, I don't think, but I cannot. Maybe I did, who cares? Be quite dangerous, Thanks. Princess! Yay, the music. I see a princess. Hey. Ray. I hope Albert's arm gets patched up all right. I am certain it will. Um, uh, <clears throat> Ray. Yeah. If I may, let me share a story from my past. Albert lost his left arm 14 years ago. Back then, I used to drag Albert and cousin Theo around, causing them much annoyance. That day was just like any other. I was playing in an isolated area of the castle, a place I fancied my own secret bastion. It was then an unfortunate accident befell me. The decrepit castle walls, long since fallen into disrepair, came falling from above. Yet I was unharmed. The one who shielded me. It was Maester Midas and Lady Malkia who saved Albert's life. But their actions served as the catalyst for the three wise men's exile from the kingdom. Some decried the transplanting of limbs between species as a vile, evil, unforgivable act. Maester Midas suffered much, but so too did Maesters Marcus, Filberto, and Lady Malkia. They were all brought before the court to answer for their blasphemous deed. And it was my lord uncle who spearheaded their persecution. The decisive act that sealed their fate was when father acquiesced to the claims. Father had no choice but to submit to my lord uncle's power, given his relation to the late empress of Vale. Maester Midas was spared the mark of treason, but ultimately banished. Lady Malkia's studies at the Semiomancy Consortium were ended, our relations with Nilbeth severed, and Maester Marcus and Filberto followed Maester Midas into the hinterlands. No wonder Midas gets so heated. Actually, I'm kind of surprised you even thought of asking Midas for help. I inquired Director Melthia about the Fulga. With it, I knew I could protect the kingdom. I beseeched Albert for his help, asked Cousin Theo to assist with arrangements. And then, Ray, I met you. Nah, I haven't done a thing. <laughs> After we met, I began to think that everything will be fine. That things will work out. I have never been so excited for the days to come. 
Thank you for listening to my overlong story. Shall we head back? No. Thank you for lending me your ear. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Do my scan. Oh. Nani. Treasure, how long you been here? Sweet. Ernest. I got Ernest. Hey. Item drop rate. Oh, that's pretty cool. What can I do out here? Is there a bunny? A bunny like last time? I can like fight and stuff. Sweet. Hold on, I wanna try. <laughs> I wanna get my ass whooped. Hey buddies, I'm not even a full life. <laughs> Fuck it. Whee! Come on, Duma. You and me, buddy. About this. Ah. Where'd you come from? Brave is too good. Doing like three or four thousand damage in just one swing. <laughs> uh. All right. Let's continue with the story, shall we? Duma me away! Let's go, princess! Thank you. Preparations complete. Are they? Barrett is holding up. Let's take a peek inside the operator. Who's in here? Seems the procedure may still take some time. Yes? No going there. Okay. We did it. Thank goodness. Another 14 years. Highness. Procedure went well then. Indeed. Behold, your highness. So, feeling ready to get back at it? Naturally. <laughs> Let us not keep Theo waiting. You said it. Let's make tracks. He's so cool. How fare you this morning, Lady Malkia? Better, after hearing the Imperial troops have left our shore. Now is the time to descend into the coil. Is it that deep? The ancient coil is sacred ground for semiomancers. It is suitably deep. Losing one's way would prove fatal. Their kind do not go astray. Their strange tools create detailed cartographs. Then, there is no reason to worry. Shall we depart? Are you coming with us, Lady Malkia? As leader of the Trathen, it would be unspeakable to not join you on our sacred grounds. There is an entrance into the coil within the village. I will meet you there after informing my people. 
Yay! The entrance to the ruins was through Malkia's room, wasn't it? Can't run. We should get down there once we're ready. Now I can run. Let's get a food bonus. Care to take a rest? This is my room. Uh This one. All right, pie. Don't let them. This is pretty good. I hope you slept well. An excellent establishment, was it not? Good morning, Albert. You're looking much better. Thank you. I feel strong enough to move mountains. I'm relieved the procedure went well. But I am afraid I come bearing ill tidings. What are you doing here? What is it? What happened to His Royal Majesty? The wounds he sustained in Baldar have worsened, leaving him bedridden. Sinister activity has also been observed around Baldar. Neon wishes for the immediate return of Her Highness. Too bad. Theo has already left Kato for the Royal City. The ship that approaches is one sent by Neon. You should go, Leticia. Now? Look, your people are calling for you in their time of need. It's them you've been fighting for all along, right? If the king has truly fallen, nothing will prevent Lambert from doing whatsoever he pleases. He may even impede our work on the Folga. I'll keep Elena updated on our situation with this. We can handle the rest here. Very well. I leave the retrieval of the Levitas ore in your hands. I was gonna put her in my party. No problem. And Albert, you'll be going with her, right? Oh no. Of course. I leave the rest here to you. Should any trouble arise, I shall inform Elena with all haste. I'll stay behind. If I left and Ray or the others got sick or hurt, They'd be in trouble. As shall I, as an authority on Levitas Or. I await good tidings in the Royal City. Yeah, we will see you soon. Well, this is the party I was using anyway, I guess. I leave the retrieval of the ore in your hands. I apologize for leaving the brunt of the work in your hands. It is. We'll make do. Good luck with the excavation. I will be standing. Yeah. Let's get to the action. After a quick save. What awaits us beyond this sparkly door? Stairs! Just as I've always dreamed. It's exciting exploring ancient ruins like this. Glad you think so, because it's about to get grimy and gloomy. No problem. Don't forget, I grew up in a mining town. A little field work like this is nothing to me. Oh, okay. Right. Well, uh, don't get too worked up either way. Oh. A door that I cannot enter? How dare you? An excellent find. That is an excellent find. I leveled up Raymond, uh, I leveled up his item crafting skill for smithing. Level six now. You know what? Let's do it for a second. Got all kinds of good high level metal now. 
let's do Mithril. What you got, Raymond? Just gotta hit it with a hammer, right? Smack that bitch with a hammer. Not what I expected. Royal Knight's Mail, huh? Oh yeah, you can try again. I uh, can't remember how good 128 and 86 is. Probably not that good. Let's do it again. Just gotta hit it with a hammer, right? Not what I expected. Tukatune Shurka! Star Ruby? Just gotta hit it with a hammer, right? Not what I expected. Try again. Just gotta hit it with a hammer. Not what I expected. Escalon bleed. Oh yeah, that's right. I got that thing that can move uh, factors around. Hmm. That's really cool, actually, because I can just make a bunch of crap, and as long as it has a good factor that I want, like bestow earth attacks or something, you know. Shooting things when you swing. Do one more. Okay, let's use one of these rune metals. Just, Just found one. Hammer, right? Get him, Raymond. What I mm. Why did it, like, sound all special? I remember having naval core armor before, so it's not, like, high grade. Let's try again. Not what I expected. Ah. Well, this item dropped right on it. <laughs> yeah, sucks ass. Wonder what the max level of item crafting skills is ten. Okay, let's get going. See what this place holds for us. Monsters! Hey, yeah. Yeah. Poke, poke, slap. You missed. Get closer, bitch. She's like stuck on nothing. I can't move there. Weird. Who's alive? You? What's happening? Destroy. Hit it. Target it. I can't target this thing. There you go. It's not hitting him. Oh my god. I don't get it. How am I supposed to hit those guys? What's this? Where are you looking? Oh, look how far down it goes. Don't fall down there. Rune metal? Ha <laughs> ha! Caught it, baby. I'm badass. Not oh, this one, this one. Poke. <laughs> ah! Wait, what's happening? What are you doing, little bitch? What in the fuck is going on? 
There. I got that so hard. <laughs> Goodbye. And froze him. I'm a lagging so goddamn much. Can I not? Can I not lag, please? Gotta turn the damn graphics down or something. I'm gonna die because of lag. Excellent find. Why? Is it lagging? So much. Load the fucking shit and let's go. I was just over here. Is that a way to go over there? It is. No! I'm an idiot. Treasure. An excellent find. Makanga of Judgment. Don't I have some of those already? Yeah. Can I make it? Oh, barely. Cool. That's a lot of stuff. I really like her basic attack. Mm, a gigantic swipe and it's really fast. Oh no! I stepped on a trap. Damn it, Malkia, you're the one who's supposed to know about these the things. What was that? Likely a trap to deter would-be intruders. We should be wary of not only enemies, but tread carefully as well. I thought you were like the knowing person. Ooh, Raymond. I want the treasure. An excellent find. Arnish sounds familiar. Trash armor. Or maybe the armor they have on right now. <laughs> Look at this guy. Oh my god, I'm slow. Help, Nina. Uh, take this. Oops, wrong button. Oh, what's everybody else doing? What are y'all fucking doing over here? God damn. Fucking use the satellites. Bam. There you go. I peed on him. Oh, Midas leveled? Nope. Sorry, buddy. Ooh. Not quite enough, I don't think. Trying to get him motor mouth. Fiashed, Kayashed. One more level and he'll get it. I'm gonna get that and then level the fuck up out of it and get it to like infinite negative casting speed time. Right, where am I? Where's it going? Where'd I come from? Apparently I haven't been over here yet. Yeah. Excellent find. Holy poly bean. There's another passage we can take here. Wait. I know not the exact locations of Levitas or deposits. We have no choice but to search thoroughly while we descend. Uh. Now. Oh. 
Wanna do it again. Yay! I'm smart. I'm smart brain. Excellent find. Yeah. Where are you looking? I get this one now. Uh, a trap. Me? Me! A wise choice. I want it. Doesn't look like there's a way on the map to get in there from the other side, but. Maybe it's a different level. Oh well. Guess we'll find out at some point. Cassine? Seen the writing on the wall. These symbols are just like the ones we saw at the shrine on Gelcolemthus. Are they? The records of all sites in the world engraved with such symbols can be traced all the way back to the ancient coil. Nina, your pendant. What? Whoa. Where did you get that? My dad gave it to me. I just assumed it was a good luck charm for Iatromancers. Do you know what it is, Uncle Midas? I am no Iatromancer. That is a question better asked of Marcus on your return to Delric. Hmm. <sighs> Does this mean Dad and Dr. Eason have been here before? The three wise men have all visited this place. So, Nina, you are Filberto's daughter. Is he in good health? He passed away seven years ago. Oh, I see. Once the realm is at peace, there is something of your father's I would return to you. You are always welcome amongst the Traffin. Nina de Forge. Thank you, Lady Malkia. Pendant stopped glowing. What about now? Dull. Okay, um. I'm gonna call the episode here, I think. We'll ascend to the next floor. Descend, I mean. To the next floor. In the next episode. <laughs> What's that? Wink. Alright. Anyways, hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.